In today's All-Star Cook-Along Challenge, the chefs are teaching athletes, WNBA superstar Candace Parker. Oh, we doing it on Oh, yeah, we doing it. NBA legend Reggie Miller. Olympic gold medalist Jordan Weber. Not too bad so far, right? No, it's easy. All right, good. You got this. And NFL All-Stars, Sean Merriman. That's perfect. And Ricky Williams. That's beautiful. Some all-star moves of their own. Three, two, one, and stop. Well done, guys. Now, here's how it's going to work. For today's judging, I'm going to taste the first dish. And that all-star team will then take a place in those chairs as king of the hill. The duo that are still sitting after all the tastings will win this challenge. Right, first up, Nick and Jordan. Let's go. We're going to bring it. I'm super nervous to go <laughs> approach Chef Ramsey. I know he's a little bit intimidating, right. and I don't know if he's going to yell at me or not. <laughs> right, uh, Jordan, describe your dish, please. So we have um, the <laughs> you got it <laughs> celery root puree, and we have peppercorn crusted scallops. The actual cook on the scallops is delicious. Good job, Jordan. I just wish we'd get Cook on the Scholar like that in service. <laughs> do you cook often? I do not, no. <laughs> really? I'm pretty good at scrambled eggs, but that's about it. <laughs> you may want to consider another career here. <laughs> Great start. Both of you, well done. You. Please job, take a seat. Good job, George. Next up, Robin and Reggie. Let's go. Good luck, y'all. We look good. We look good. We cook well. And we're going to win this thing. Reggie, describe the dish, please. This is seared scallops in a uni sauce. Pasta's cooked. Excellent. It's fresh, it's clean, and it's vibrant. But for me, the hero of this is the scallops. Each and every one of them being seared nice. beautifully. You said it. You so, said it. You said it. Tough one. We had more scallops. We only have three or four scallops. So, I mean, I could do four scallops in my sleep. But I love the competitive spirit, Reggie. <laughs> Does it outshine Nick and Jordan? Yes, it does outshine. Yeah! OK! Please take a seat. Oh, um, oh, my goodness. Sorry, Nick and Jordan, but this throne is now ours. Are you kidding me? We are now the king, king of the, of the hill. hill. Bye bye. Oh. Nice job, boss. <laughs> right, so, uh, next up, Millie and Ricky. Let's go. We got sea bass three ways. Three delicious ways. I mean, I I'm telling you, when you taste each one, Case buds explode, I, I, don't, I don't see how we can lose at all. So describe the dish, please. We wanted to take sea bass and do it different ways. So here we have a fritter, we have the pan seared sea bass with the risotto, and over here we have poached sea bass on a, a fennel and apple salad. Right. Love the risotto and the sea bass. Um, love the fritter. So does it beat Robin and Reggie? Yes, it does. Yes. Congratulations. Yes. Wow. Yes. Well done, guys. Yes. Yeah. Hell yeah. Get up out of here, Robin and Reggie. Bye and bye. You, and you can't put your leg out on this one, Reggie. No fouls. <laughs> <laughs> okay, up next, Michelle and Candace, please. Excuse me. Bring it home, Candace. Excuse Bring, me. It home. Bring it home, Candace. She just straight elbowed me. All right, we have a pasta tossed in uni sauce, seared sea bass, and miso beet puree. Great color on the skin here. Love that. Sea bass is cooked to perfection. That is beautiful. But does it beat Millie's? It's a tough one. Um, I'd like Michelle and Candice to take a seat, please. Yeah! Okay. Wow. Nice. Oh, good job. Last one. Let's go. Benjamin and Sean. Oh, yeah, it's game time. It's on. We want to win. That's I right. Mean, I know Sean wants to win. I want to win. They are going down. Thank you. He's a really good competitor, so let's see. Right, uh, Sean, what was it like cooking in the house kitchen? It was a workout. I was in there sweating the whole time, and I looked over and I seen Reggie. I said, OK, he's sweating more than me, so I'm not that bad out of shape. <laughs> Describe the dish, please. So we got a smoked lamb loin and roasted cauliflower. Oh, wow. A lamb's cooked beautifully. Let's get that right. Inside is uh, pink. Sean's nickname, as you know, is Lights Out. Is it going to be Lights Out for Michelle and Candace? That's a really tough one. Um, the dish is not as good as Michelle and Candace's. Yeah! Congratulations. <laughs> we won. Yes! <laughs> Yay, we won! Woo! We got to hit the, like this? And then okay. the spoon. On the spoon? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> 
Candice, Reggie, Jordan, Sean, and Ricky, thank you so much. Best wishes and continued success. It's nice meeting you. Thank you. Thank you. Best of luck to you guys. Thank, thank you. you. You didn't see that one coming this morning, did you? <laughs> no. <laughs> what a turnout of athletes. Michelle, I have an amazing day for you. You're going to be treated to the most amazing, breathtaking views of downtown Los Angeles. Oh. All from your very own helicopter. <laughs> now, once you've flown high above the sky, get ready to die in the clouds at 71 above. <laughs> a Russian that is 1,000 feet above the ground. Wow. Oh, my god. This reward is so special that it shouldn't be experienced alone. Take a moment. Nick, chef. Thanks, Michelle. You're welcome, Nick. Michelle, Nick, your chopper is taking off soon. Congratulations. Thank you. Oh, Nick, come on. <laughs> of course I was going to pick you. Oh, my god. Yay! <sighs> Today in Hell's Kitchen, it is deep cleaning day. Oh. Our red carpet's taking a beating. So, brush, brush, brush. Make sure there's not an ounce of dirt anywhere. Got me? Yes, yes, sir. Chef. yes, chef. Please jump back in the kitchens. Off you go. Oh, man. They're getting a ride around in the helicopter. But I will never forget this day because we got a chance to teach all star athletes how to cook in the kitchen with us. This is the real deal. Listen, if I'm going to clean up your kitchen and you leave some food over, thank you for the gift. I just had some of your lamb. I got to sample almost everybody's dish. Oh, that's all that. Candace Parker, you killed that dish. Y'all deserve the win. Yes! Yay. Yes! Oh, my God, look Woo. at this helicopter! Oh, my God, that's crazy. <laughs> Thank you for taking me. I'm so nervous. Heights and me do not go well together, so good thing I'm wearing an extra pair of underwear. <laughs> Ready, Nick? I'm so nervous. No, no I'm excited, nervous. excited, excited, nervous. Excited, excited, nervous. Ah, we're floating. <laughs> this is cool. Oh, my god. Ah! Oh, look at the Hollywood sign. Oh, my god. It's right there. Oh, that's cool. Hey, Kim Kardashian. Hey, Beyonce. Oh, hey, Britney Spears. I'm glad I'm conquering my fears. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, there's so many buildings. That's stunning. Someone as pretty as me. Awesome. So pretty this here. is beautiful. Welcome to 71 and Bob. Thank, Thank you. you. Follow me. Oh, I'm so excited. Things I never thought I'd be doing, taking a helicopter and looking at this view right now. Yeah. Oh, my god. Thank you so much. It's beautiful. Yeah. It's like off the cover of a magazine. Doesn't it? We're here again, black jackets. Last time, I don't think we were ready. I think this time, it's our time. I think it's the final two. I yeah. really do. Nick and I do have a special bond. We shared season 14 together, those experiences, and we've kept that friendship throughout this season. He's like my right-hand man, and he's definitely got my back. Backing this shows how it. immature you Your are. numbers ain't backing up shit. Elise, you're a fucking bully. I'm not even talking to you. Fine, check the scoreboard. Yeah. Boop, 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 boop. I would rather spend this lunch with him than anyone else in Hell's Kitchen. Cheers to the final two. Yes. Cheers to the youngest chefs, and I hope the old geriatrics are having fun back in Hell's <laughs> Kitchen. Geriatrics, bye. <laughs>